This is Tori Birch. Never Tori heard Tori of Birch. her. Let me get a price tag. Was she cute? Right now, size 32, brand new, still got the thing on That's here. That's my size. What do you think these cost? What do you think these cost? Like a good $200, $300 at most, at least. $200, $300 most? No, $300 at most. Comment below, everybody, what you think this costs. I'm going to tell you right now. It's time to have some wine and wine. Here we are, Princess Pirate, going to move our storage unit. Big East West Coast collab, we gotta do our unboxing right now. So we're about to see what we got. I have a hopeful feeling that I might have bought the best one. All right, here we go. 139, let's see what we got in here. Why did I buy this one? Uh, like I said, I wanted to go with quality over quantity. I know everybody's looking to get the top three items in this coast of the most, the coast with the most challenge here from the uh, East Coast, West Coast collab. And I liked quality. These couches here, like I was stating, um, they could be low-end Ikea, which is a several hundred bucks, but they could also be something very expensive, and they could be two, three, four, five thousand dollars couches. I loved the Art Deco. See the style here? You got a little bit of this and that with a little bit of that. Blend it all together. That is Art Deco, modern Danish. Not really modern Danish, because it's not Danish, but it's modern. You see, everything's like that. Everything is kind of just a little, a little bit artsy. So it makes you believe when you see all this clothes here, and you see everything the way it is, that there's potentially something good. Let me tell you something here. Let me tell you one of my trade secrets. This is a trade secret now. When you buy a story, I'm gonna tell you one item I look for. I'm not gonna tell you all the items I look for, but very important, when somebody has a storage and they store stuff. Now, if you're living, now uh, let's take the camera and point to what I'm talking about. If you look at this mattress right here, it's very well taken care of. And that is important. Anybody who has a mattress, if they lay their head on something and it's dirty as hell, you have to think they've taken abuse to everything they have. Now, when you see a mattress that looks like these, you understand right away, these people took care of their stuff. Psychology, Storage Pirate 101, let's go. Here's the tabletops. They look in pretty good shape. Obviously, I might need to do a little wiping. So you don't get the tour when you see stuff like that. That's just a little bit of Windex, a little bit of something, something. That's going to look perfectly brand new, clean. And if you look under here, Here's a tag, coasters, furniture, not bad. These are authentic, authentic recycled glass. So we are also being green when we buy our storage units by Vidros San Miguel, handmade in Spain. Home goods compare at 58, they only wanted 34, not bad. Here we have two more. What's the price tag on this one? $12.99. So look, I'm with my homies. No? no. Right. $29.99. This would be cool if like you're drinking, you gotta go to the store, you wanna get seven up and you're like, no. Can you imagine drinking that though? This one was on clearance. I love the clearance rack. You know how dad is when he goes to Walmart. This is a cool store. Look at this. Uh, I need a little bit of your magic touch on that. This work. There we go. It was set for Alex on the little lower one. This one's set for me. Shout out to you, Alex. Storage stock from a homie. Here we have a pistol. This is nice. This has suctional technology. That is awesome. You know why? Because yeah. vacuum suck. The illumination station. Mirror, nice, mirror right? on the wall. Who's the baddest of them? One second, let me get me in there too. It's us. Yep. This is cute. This is really cute. You know what this is? The Eiffel Tower. Oh, I thought this was Big Ben. Sorry. You're right. It's the Eiffel Tower. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. What goes in here? You want to tell the whole world what you put in there? Do you put like... Wine bottles in there. Wine bottles? Yeah. What do you know about wine? I don't know. That just seems oh, like it would fit in it's there. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. Yeah, this is pretty cool. Is it for wine bottles? Yeah, it's for wine bottles. You could put you could put other bottles in there too. Could just be for decoration. I'm right, guys. <laughs> She's right. Wine's not good though. Ooh. What do you think? These these are weird. The way they have the glass on the bottom. Are you sure the glass is on the bottom? No, set it oh, the other way. My bad, my bad. Look at that. Tempered glass. 
tempered. It reminds me of you, the salt princess. Tempered. Why would you put the glass on the bottom? Well, you know why they did that, girl? Because they were stacking them on each other, and the other one was right side up. No, I'm meaning why would you think the glass was put on the bottom? I was just being a wise guy. He's not funny, y'all. Those are, they're from California. Nope, that's not where they're from. Um, those are pretty nice. Go ahead and get a little closer up here. These right here are very modern as well. Artsy. They're not super high end by the wood. They're particle board, but they do have the look. So these are actually going to be probably 50 to 100 bucks. And that's I sell them with the couch set. Feel me? Yes. These... Please handle it with care, thank you. They're fragile like my ego. Oh, it says I can't use a knife. Uh -huh. oh, uh, out of whack here. I'm gonna get, I'm just gonna go out on the limb. I think it might have something to do with that tape. But I could be wrong, no! What are these? It's a patio, it's a, uh, I don't know. What does it look like, a living room table set or something? No, you know what, they are the chairs, huh? They're more stools. Did we bring out a stool already? Yeah. We did. Where'd it go? Okay, they're not a stool, so what I'm guessing is possibly these are just the actual chairs. These are the straight up chairs that have never been put together. Yep. Brand new chairs. I think that we're gonna probably get enough money. We paid 400, 400 for this unit. I think that this table is gonna pay for this unit. Two ones. One. And another one. This one says, oh, we got something here. Why didn't anyone else try to bid you up on this unit? Oh, they did. I power bid it. Somebody was like 25, I was like 100. Then somebody was like 120, I was like 200. Then he said 225, I said 400. And then nobody bid again. You have to know your auctioneer. So the, the beauty of this auction, are we filming? Are we filming? Yeah. The beauty of this auctioneer is he bids fast. He's like, so, so if you're like 20 and then you're, you're lagging on your next one, you're gonna be 25, you wait like four seconds, he's already irritated. He sells it like you know. There's silence for three to four seconds sold. So on these type of units, you want to shout a high number because it, it distracts everybody. And then he just says, "So look at that. These are freaking nice. Look at that. Let me pull one out of here. Let me pull one out of here. So we can see. He's also really good at breaking ties. Breaking ties or noticing ties, like tie bids. Oh, I thought you said breaking ties. I'm good at walking away, so I thought that's what you're talking about. Oh, that's a good thing to say. That's a great thing to say. Look at that. What is that? That's the chair. So you, these are brand spanking new. Global furniture is what it says on there. That's the back. See, it's an arch like that, so when you sit up against it, and then the, the chrome pieces come like that with the white lever. You don't think we're gonna get 400 bucks for this set now? No, I need to see how these chairs look. I'm so confused. Okay, here's the chair, right? The other piece that was like a Z goes like this. So it goes boom, 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 right? Uh -huh. And then the white leather comes off the top of it. I definitely think we're getting 400 for a uh, lease on this set. Are you supposed to be trash talking in your videos still? Um, well, the East did a fair attempt at trash talking, and I didn't think it was really a... Uh, it was really significant towards my skills of trash talking. So I kind of let them have a little bit, but I figured there's no competition to trash talking. I'm just going to leave it up to the stores to just speak for itself. Ooh, I think that was a fourth degree burn. He said y'all's trash talking wasn't good enough. Ready? Yeah, it's been recording. What do we have here? Who's this? Michael Jordan. Who's Michael Jordan? A basketball player. What kind of basketball Your player? Your favorite basketball player. And? The person I'm named after. You actually are named after the greatest basketball player on the oh. earth was the correct answer. Well, and yes, your name is Michaela Jordan. All of my answers were correct answers. Oh. Well, there's some are more correct answers. What do we got in here? A pair of shoes, Alex. What, what number want. are we going to open it on? 82? Yeah. Okay. One. 82. Two. <laughs> three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Just kidding. Darn. Woo! Let's see what we got here. Go ahead. So, so far, I don't know what the heck they're buying here. What are that? Ladies footwear, 179. Let's see something else here. Footwear, 179. There we go. We got shoes. 
True religions? We better find some Let's of see that. see what else we got in here. $495 for some Salvatore Ferragamo. Ferragamo. Look at the price on that. Yeah, that's, in, that's nuts. What do we got here? A play card? Dave and Buster's? Gift card, call it. Come on, $1,000. Must be expensive. You know how everybody pays extra for the holes nowadays. They're Polo Ralph Lauren. These are. What do you think these are worth? Um. I mean, resale. What are we gonna get? Probably twenty. Yeah. But these are probably what? One hundred fifty, two hundred dollars jeans in the store. I just how I'd wear them too, like this. Yeah, you probably would. We have something here with a tag. Nice. What? We, this has a tag on it. It's a size small. Let's see if it fits me. No, it doesn't. What do you think? No. Just walk up in the club like this. Hey, what's up, ladies? No? Okay. No. Can you help me? Oh, my gosh. Now, we have a price tag on you. Let's see. This is a Vince jacket. The brand is Vince. Right now, it's Vince. Everybody right now, comment below what you think this vest costs. Because we're about to find out. What's your guess, Salt Princess? $72. $72? Yeah. Wanna see? Yeah. $695. $695 from Nordstrom's. Boom. This one vest cost more than I spent on this entire unit. I'm not a big clothes person, but I felt something was potentially quality on this clothes. $695. Timbo's. Timberlands? Yeah, these are, uh, you might actually fit in these. It could be good work boots for you. These were actually pretty popular back when I was in school when I was your age. People like, love Tim's. Stuff. They do love Tim's? They're still popular? Yeah, if you have Tim's, they're cool. All right, so we need to start. What in the world are these? Daisy these Dukes. Like Mike Tyson's boxing shorts. They're Daisy Dukes for you. These look extremely small and tight. I bet you uh, Mr. Hales will wear these. All right, Jeremy, he's calling you out. Shout out to you, Jeremy, with the Hales. What was the price tag on them? They didn't have a price. This right here. You know what this is, girl? Table piece. Table leaf? Table piece. Yeah, it's a table leaf. So it basically, see, I see how they have the uh, zoom in there as I'm saying this? See how they have the black strip right there? Mm -hmm. That's basically the same pattern. So you get the black strip in the middle, then this is for when you expand for company when you come over. Say you got the whole family, in-laws come over, you want to I know them. what a table leaf is. Oh. I wasn't sure. Zara, man. I don't know nothing about this. I kind of like this, though, because I was told Jeebus the other day when I was to wear a Michael Jackson jacket. I don't know if anybody remembers these back in the 80s. They would have three zippers here, five here, four here, like three here. I used to wear one of those in like the fourth grade. Would that fit me? Zara Man. I don't know. Anybody out there knows what Zara Man costs? Please comment below on what you think that is, the value is on that. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hells to the air. Oh, hells yeah. Look at this. What is that? Versace. Versace, Versace, Versace. That is kind of cute. I like it. You would probably wear that, huh? I totally would. How much is it worth to you? What are you willing to pay for this? Because I need to know I'm doing a competition. Those dirt funny. spots on the side are turning me off right now. You think Mimi could get that out? Hold on a second. Look, it's new. <laughs> are, you, are you going? Yes, sir. Look at this. Is this the butterfly effect? Uh, that looks like a transformer. Look oh, at that brand. Do you hear me? Givenchy? Never heard of a Givenchy. You never heard of a Givenchy? No. Well, you need to go on Wikipedia then. That's it, money right there. Is it expensive? We're, we're looking like we got some really good clothes here. I'm stopping and starting. If I had wings, I would fly. Let me contemplate. I glance in the cup. Are those Robins? Are, the, are they Robins? Hold on a second. You don't want to see the price tag. Hold on a second. They're Robin jeans. Look at this. You're robbing my jeans? That's the brand, Dad. They're Robin jeans. Okay. Fetty Wap raps about it in his... Ooh, Fetty Wap. Now, everybody, right now, size 32. Brand new. Still got the thing on That's here. That's my size. What What do you think these cost? Like a good $200, $300 at most. 
At least. 200, 300 at most? No, 300 at most. Comment below, everybody, what you think this costs. I'm going to tell you right now. Holy. I $445. I'm sorry, y'all, but I did that. <laughs> wow. Here we go. True religion. That's true religion. Used. Not in the greatest shape. Well, I'm getting a little excited here. This is neat. Yeah, stop getting me so excited, bro. You just showed me white jeans. Another Zara. I can picture Kanye West wearing this. Could you picture Kanye West wearing a jacket like I was that? thinking of like the Terminator or something. Rant, you'd be up on the internet ranting. I was thinking of the Terminator. These match the white leather, but it's not the same brand. It is a Zara man. Made in China, Euro, USA, Mexico. White leather. Stop can you second. hold on? I don't know. Uh, it makes you wonder what they were doing, why they got all this stuff with price tags. And they didn't want to pay it either yeah. to keep it. So weird. Did they die? I don't know. It doesn't have the actual price tag on it. We got another Zara. We didn't, I think we got Kanye's unit. <laughs> There's no Yeezys in here. I just, yeah, but he probably can't afford his own shoes either. <laughs> cool. That yes, looks like look a... At look at this. It's all rugged. Motorcycle jacket. Spiked collar, size extra small. Pause, pause, pause. That's a little man. What do you think this one? Well, the purse I put on eBay was like a hundred, so let's. Everybody, right now, comment below what do you think this guess jacket sells for. Go ahead. Like one fifty. Holy! Why am I so off? Four ninety eight. Jesus. Four ninety eight, holy Jeebus! That's what I was gonna tell you to say. This is Tori Birch. Never you know heard Tory of Birch? her. We got a price tag. Was she cute? Two hundred and fifty dollars. Woo! These are marked down. They're slimmy for all mankind. You can wear them too, baby girl. <laughs> I only wear designer. One hundred and ninety eight marked down to one forty nine. Boom. Don't get much more designer than that, does it? Oh, yes, it does, because we got some $500 pants and the jackets over here. Those might go missing. You might want to keep an eye on them. What? Those Robin jeans. This is a priceless sheet. Is this a schlong? Like one of those things when you go to the beach and the women want to get dressed up and they wear them like this and then they go... It's a toga. Maybe. It's just with blue so instead of an like all-white. Yeah, something like that. It's probably one of those fancy... You know how people have the scarves and they can make like 300 different It's a babushka. It's a babushka. It's, I think it's priceless. I think it's worth like a good... That's exactly how you wear it. 350 scarf, blanket, and a hair tie all at once. Designer. Okay, good kind. It's Gucci. These are the same brand. No price tag. Still These are kind of cute. Like me? My kind of cute? Um, Here you go, girl. I can see you wearing these. Look at these. Yeah, I could wear those. I would look at the pocket, man. He must have yeah. a big wallet. That would fit your wad of money. No, I know what. Big wad, take little wad. Big wad, take little wad. You would totally West wear Coast those, though. East Coast. <laughs> Coast with the most. Those are kind of cute, too. Those are kind of cute, too. Oh. What's the brand? Oh. We're not going to discuss that brand. Are you serious, bro? No, because you already said you like that brand, and I don't want you trying to take them all. All right, it's true religion. We'll get back to that True's. later. Are these Jordans? I tried to give these to Baby Jeebus yesterday. These? Yeah. Why didn't he take them? Because he's well, I don't know. They, he he's only like three foot seven. <laughs> Got a size four. <laughs> I guess those shoes were a little big for him. Oh, I thought you were being serious. They're too small for him. They're too small for Baby. Eyes odds. We're getting into lower end brand. Look at that. Ten dollars Marshalls. Oosh. We like Marshalls though. Don't don't knock them. I'm not. I love Marshalls too. I'm just saying, we got some low-end stuff here. We're not going to underestimate it. Do any of them fit your son? American Eagle. These probably fit Michael, huh? He could wear some Capri pants at school. No, I like those. Steady camera. All right, so if you're going to want to see the rest of this video, if you're going to want to find out what I got in the rest of this unit, and if it possibly is the reason why the West was won, then you're going to have to wait to see the next video. We'll be coming soon. Tap in, so like, share, subscribe, all those good things.